the moment we introduced Sandy, it was part of their lives. They, of course, would ride Sandy when they went to the store. And it was their expectation, as it has been for so many other children, that that was part of that Meyer experience. The first Sandy galloped into our lives when I was 10 years old with the opening of our first big Meyer store in Grand Rapids. Supermarkets had become exciting places filled with all kinds of remarkable innovations and real destinations for American families. And when we built the first big store, there was an opportunity to really increase that sense of this is a place to come, a place to play, a place to socialize. And so it seemed only natural to investigate some of the opportunities to entertain children. And so that's when we found Sandy. But it also came with a 10 cent sign on it, painted right on that horse. My dad looked at that and said, no way. And this is in 1962, so this is more than 50 years ago. That seemed like too much money for a parent to put their child on the horse just for a few moments of fun. And so, we immediately took that 10 cents and changed it to one cent, and that made Sandy the Pony available to everyone. That one penny is important to us today because there's still a value in that little boy or that little girl putting a penny in the machine and making it come to life, but it also is something that we can all afford. And that's that perfect balance of value and low prices that we'd like to think Meyer represents. Well, we now have generations of customers, mothers and fathers who rode Sandy when they were little, and now their children are climbing into Sandy's saddle. And that's just fun to see. We talk about every child having an opportunity to ride Sandy when it's only a penny a ride. But what's been fascinating to see in the last few years is how increasingly people will leave a penny at their end of their ride, as though to pay forward someone else's opportunity and perhaps there's a lesson there about generosity that our children begin to learn. That someone helps them ride Sandy, they're going to help someone else ride Sandy. This is one of those things that starts out as an amusement, as one more element of what you hope is an exciting shopping experience. And then over time, it becomes part of your heritage. And so Sandy is still a pony after all these years, but Sandy is a part of the lives of our customers. And we'd love it that that's the case, and that's why we're committed to one cent for as long as we can see. Any organization has to understand the importance of adapting to the future and not clinging to old ways. At Meyer, we like to say we don't have any sacred cows, but we do have a sacred pony.